Welcome back friends, followers and transients to another episode of Banished with me, Vapor and yes, hopefully my voice doesn't sound too terrible but <laughs> kind of get in there, um, not spoke much the last couple of days but um, yeah, I'm kind of feeling like uh, I can do this I've, I've recorded two videos for two other games and my voice is still okay so fingers crossed um, it doesn't just die um, during this. I'm, I'm hoping it doesn't. Um, so just kind of going off um, comments from the last video. We are going with the normal grass square. A few of you mentioned about putting like sand in this kind of zen garden area. I'm going to have to kind of look up kind of zen gardens. I mean I've seen the little ones you can have on your desk and they have like a little rake where you can rake the sand and place stones and stuff. I'm guessing that's what you're thinking but just for me to kind of wrap my head around that um, I'll probably leave that until I've done that little bit of research because I'm not like entirely sure if I'm honest with you so it's not not something I'm 100% au fait with so yeah um, I want to kind of run a fence if possible kind of along this, this riverbank um, and I'm guessing this be, just because I don't know I don't want to leave it open like like it is it just looks a little bit strange to me to have it that way so I'm gonna try and do something yeah that that looks like it belongs almost I, don't, I just just that, that abrupt edge just doesn't work for me so we're gonna tinker around and see if we can put something in here that makes sense this corner I might need to adjust just a little bit but the, the ground is sort of raising. There we go. So it doesn't look too bad. But this, this corner here, I think we're just going to have to kind of tweak that a little bit. I don't want to take over the river completely, but it just this looks sort of odd to me. So we're going we're gonna to drop these in here. May as well put one there too. And it, it, it just, I don't know, I feel like it will work a little bit better. Man, there's so much going on. Oh, the market's almost done. Um, I'm guessing we've not got bricks. I think we must we must need to make some bricks. We can do that. So I, you can't physically spawn resources in, but once you have them, you kind of can, I think. So it gets a little bit confusing. We need to put some more market stuff in here and probably something over this side. Um, we still got... Yes, yeah, a couple of bits over here. Going to do this. I'm, I'm trying. Uh, of what I think I want to do is, I think we're okay with this area, right? I don't think we need to add anything else to this. I mean, I could stick crates everywhere, but I don't feel like we need to do anything else to this. But I feel like we should finish this and kind of this area that we're working on now. Um, <laughs> go back to the very beginning almost and do this and do this before we really expand into the city because um, it will completely get forgotten about because I'll keep saying, yep, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do this and guess what, Vapor won't do it because I know what he's like, I have to live with him of course it's uh, it's not much fun <laughs> but uh, yeah, no, we will, we will do it and uh, if my voice does continue to be a bit of a struggle um, or, I, or I do have issues with it then I could just do an entire time lapse like I wouldn't need to talk which is not what I want to do because I know there is people that watch me because of my voice. That sounds a little bit weird saying that. But they, they enjoy listening. Um, I don't even know how to word it. You guys know what I mean. I, I don't know. Because I, I, I can't listen to myself. I mean, I have to do it. I'm editing videos and things. But, yeah. Well, uh, we'll stop out there. Because it's making me feel slightly awkward. I don't know. I don't know how to, how to word it. But, yeah. How can we make this section here work? Will that do it for me? I think it will. Just going into there a little bit. I just can't leave that tiny little gap. If it's got a tiny little gap, I have to fill it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to ignore what I've just said. But I, I kind of can't because I'm childish like that. But um, we'll leave that to the uh, the, the other childish people um, in amongst the community to, uh, to respond to that. Because I know you're out there. Um, helps if you get the right piece. There we go. 
Hmm. That'd be better more here, I think, wouldn't it? Yeah. Let's get rid of you. I love it when they have this little removal piece right there. It just makes life so much easier. This tree is in a bit of an awkward place. So is it going to be that one? It is. Perfect. And... Can we... Oh man, it's got to go through the other side. I think, I think we, can, we can do something with that. There we go. Is that about right? No, I think that's slightly off, isn't it? Although that may be the ticket right there. Help it! You know, I literally can never click the right one for this. Hmm. It's gonna need to <laughs> see. Told you. Will it come this way? I think yeah. That's probably about right. Do we need to go another one? I'm probably going to have to tweak the terrain here a little bit. Nah, you're not going to play nicely, are you? You're not going to want to line up. So do we need to put one like you? And then... Is it going to be the same piece? I think it is. It is going to be the same piece. Right, okay. So you're not what we need, and you are. So if we... Actually, I think, as soon as I put some kind of terrain down here, let's put sand for argument's sake. Um, I'm not sure which one. Do we go with that one? It's like different ones, so... We'll have to see what you, what you guys think. Now this should, hopefully, raise the terrain enough so it doesn't look really peculiar. Across here. Oh, we've got grass in this side, so we're going to need to de deal with that as well. This might not be the, the correct sand, but... Maybe... Maybe I need to put something here to separate this area. Let me just put that there. Hopefully it'll remove that tree. We need something here. Even if it's the white fence. Or some trees. I'm not sure. And we need some benches, and that was uh, quite rightly pointed out in the comments. I think it was um, put as pews initially, but yeah. Do we go with these ones? I mean, this would be as close to a pew as you would get, because it looks like a bench. So maybe if we... Do something like... That's about right, isn't it? Yeah. And the same again. I don't think there's anything in the game I could use. Although I'll have a look in a second. Like, these decorative ribbons for Christmas. But I don't think there's anything that would that would work in... Oh, I don't know, actually. Oh, it's a shame I can't attach them to this. Uh, what else have we got? We've got love hearts. Yeah. What about to the bushes? I think maybe they're too far. Yeah, that's not going to quite work. I wonder. I wonder if. What am I looking for? It's in here somewhere. Can we be sneaky and do something like this? Let's see which one we got. Let's put one that way, because that one's kind of aligned in the middle, and that one's a little bit further out. Let's try that. Uh, here we go. <laughs> That's annoying. It's not... Oh, no, you can't move it around. Ah! The F variant to the rescue. Have we got one that's a little bit higher, by any chance? That probably was the one, and I've just skipped past it. Okay, so that works. What about flowers? Is it the same way? The problem is, is the ribbon is that way around. Okay, so let's... I think there is probably... <laughs> How many different F variants are there? Oh, that's going to be slightly annoying. 
Can we get you to come further forward? Come on, come for Oh, so annoying. Okay, let's try it with this one. Right, okay. So I think it's going to be this middle... Middle post, like so. So let's get rid of you. Let's see if we can get the same one. I think we skipped past it. So it's different. They're all aligned slightly differently. So potentially, we can um, we can probably place some of those bouquets actually where we want them. Okay, so that is floating a little bit in front, isn't it? I wonder if you can actually position it any closer. I don't think we can without it actually getting now. So, I mean, when you look at it from here, it looks like they're hanging. But, I mean, you can't really see them from there anyway, because it kind of disappears. But, yeah, I don't know. What about the flowers? Yeah, they're on the same sort of level, aren't they? I don't think, because they're not designed necessarily to be placed there. I think they're designed to be placed on the doors of houses. Nah, <laughs> it's not going to let me place it there. Of course it isn't, because that would be too perfect. Well, that's, that's cool anyway. I mean, just having having those there is uh, something different. It's a shame that, that we can't place them actually on the, uh, what was it, the gazebo. That is slightly unfortunate. Okay, well, that's cool. Um, what else do we have? Let's have a see. Ghost objects. I kind of know what I'm looking for. Hmm. Although some of these may be kind of pretty enough. Huh. It just feels like it needs some more stuff. Do you know what I mean? It just feels a little bit... I don't know, it just feels like it needs something. Let's put some colourful flowers in here, I mean, for the lack of anything else. I mean, we could put bushes, but... What else do we got in here? What about... We can go back to the one we just put down. Is it that one? I think it is. Yeah. I don't know, it just... It's kind of frustrating in a sense. I just... Don't you don't feel like you've got what you actually need? This is very Zen garden -y, isn't it? <laughs> some, some kind of fairy. Um, hmm. About... Yeah, that's going to look a little bit overgrown. I do like these bushes, though. So Some of these may come in handy for down the side here. Yeah. I was going to put, like, tables and stuff for food, but I, f I feel like... I don't know. You, I mean, you'll have to give me your opinion on this, but... Would it feel a little bit crammed? To have, like, two or three... It would, wouldn't it? Maybe if I hadn't have put this over here, we could have had some tables. So maybe the Zen Garden can go and we can have some kind of area with um, tables and things like that. And the, and the barbecue, I think it is, that somebody mentioned. Well, uh, I'm trying to think who it was. I can't remember because it feels like it was about a week ago. Um, it was, yeah, one of these because it attracts people. So maybe the Zen Garden can go and we can and do tables and stuff. Let me know what you think because I'm, you know, kind of clutching at straws there. Not Not too sure exactly where to go with that but I think let's go with those bushes that I was looking at a minute ago were they in here were they in here because I can't remember yes they were 
we can see what we got. They they are a very similar style. Okay. Something. Oh, let's put two of them together. That's a little bit of a nice contrast, if if you ask me. And maybe something like that. What have we got? That kind of works. Something like so, maybe. Yeah. And we've got slightly smaller ones, just to thin it out if we need to. Kind of like that. That works for me. And we'll just. We can sneak some of these kind of in. Just to kind of get rid of the harsh edges that you tend to get. Because of the way the bushes are, are made. I think, and then we got these sort of stuff, isn't it? Yeah. So let's have a little bit of a tinker around under here. Slightly bigger one. Hmm. I don't know. I'm <laughs> getting carried away myself, which is naturally what happens when I play a game like this. Maybe, yeah, maybe that will work. I can always put some other little bits along here later on, but it's kind of, I'm just thinking it's going to be quite busy here. The people are to and fro in back from like the, the harbour area. Just a bit of like a like a bit of a, a seclusion area, so to speak. I think that would work quite nice. We're in early spring, so we're getting to the point of where most of this should look pretty again. But we can just expedite that a little bit. There we go. And these all have nice little flowers too, so nice little bit of extra colour. This place it actually is looking quite good. I kind of like it. It's not it's not what I envisioned initially. I mean I had train tracks coming through here, didn't I? And now Now it's looking fairly interesting. Oh, I just had a thought. Oh, it's dangerous when that happens. What about Can we make this work? I mean we could have a lantern through the whole thing if I really wanted to. But can we these are like single things, aren't they? Yeah. Then we've got these. And these are going to fit in certain places that are here. Hmm. Can we... Can we make this work? I'm not sure. Okay, let's try this, this one here. It kind of is in the middle, isn't it? Yeah. See, from my point of view, you can't see where that's hanging. I mean, maybe from that angle, but from here, it looks like it's hanging from there. Maybe if we adjust that slightly. Maybe, maybe there's one that's a little higher up. So annoying when you want something to look a certain way and you just can't you can't quite get what you want I mean that would look cool right in the middle but depends where you're looking from if you're looking from here it looks like it is but it's clearly not although that looks like it's attached to there hmm I mean, I do like the idea of the lanterns. That's a little bit too long. I don't want to cram this area too full of stuff, though. That's, that's the one thing I am cautious of. There may be too much going on here. And 
then we're going to need the... Um, I'm assuming there's poles that are long enough for this, right? Or maybe not. So maybe... Yeah. See, we might have to move this stuff and, and put some kind of tree in here. Like that way it would... Well, it's going to have to be a ghost version of said tree. One that will uh, want to play ball, that is. <laughs> yeah, that's the only thing with the ghost ones. Although, I don't need to necessarily... It depends how the game interacts with the uh, the lights. Is it the light it's having an issue with, or is it the pathway? I don't think there is any road there, is there? No, there isn't. So, the game is having an issue with the uh, the actual lantern itself. Hmm. Can't have it just hanging that way. How else could we... How could we get that to work? Hmm. Would that look... Would that look right? Would that look like it's attached to it? I mean, I don't know. I feel I feel like we're onto something, but it's not it's not quite right. Something's something's missing. Um I, th I think I'm going to need your help with this one. I mean, I can completely remove it. I don't know. I'm just trying to make it look a little bit more fancy, like it should be lit up and things, but maybe you can think of a different way of doing this. Yeah, I don't know. I could just remove it completely. I just I literally, I'm just playing around with different things. I, I like the idea of trying stuff and really stretching the imagination a little bit. And okay, it doesn't always work. Sometimes it does. But sometimes it inspires you guys enough to kind of give me a better way of doing it. And I think that would be, uh, that'd be quite helpful in this situation. As well as deciding if we're going to keep this or having like an eatery sort of an area. Um... I think, I mean, I, I know where I'm, I'm kind of going with it, but it's up to you guys. Because I really enjoy the input. We do need to put some markets down here. How are we getting on here? That looks like this person is plowing the logs. Did I put an extra wood chopper in here? Because we got trees where we didn't have trees before. I can't seem to see them, but maybe the, the land has just grown naturally. Although it does need a road coming up to this bridge. So let's um let's chuck that in while I think about it. I think it's a stone road. What we're we using over here? Ah, I think we're using one of the colonial charter roads. I think it's the uh, is it the Moss Road? It certainly is. That almost feels like it should be a double road though, but it it won't make sense because the bridge isn't double, but. That's one way across here. And we need to do something with this as well. Hmm. This all needs removing. There's so much things here to, to get rid of. Although we've not got a crematorium. <laughs> Maybe we could have a crematorium right on the embankment. I don't know. We have the actual church itself. I don't know. We'll figure something to go here. I can't leave it completely blank. It looks slightly odd. But it, it is really getting kind of a, a bit of a personality, a bit of a life. Just kind of when I when I look at it, I can feel that it actually almost feels like it could possibly be somewhere where people would live. And that's that's nice. I've not had that feeling in Banish for a while. Because you always play in the way the game wants you to play. But now I'm just kind of decorating and placing things how I think they should go. I think it just makes such a huge difference. Anyway, I think I'm going to leave this episode right here. So until next time, as always, take care.